said, this is flesh of my flesh and bone of my bone. She shall be called woman. It was all woman when you saw me. Any real people in this room. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. This is Life is Barb. I know it's been a hot, hot minute. Yes, I'm fully aware. But um, I've had a couple other things going on. But coming up shortly, I have a few videos for you guys. And I hope you enjoy. Please like and subscribe and share with your friends. As you can see from the title of this video, this is going to be a shoe haul, shoe pickup, contemporary and designer. Um, these are my first few designer shoe purchases. Um, quickly, I think it's becoming an addiction. Um, so let's get started. I'm not going to chit chat too, too much. You guys are here to see the shoes, right? So the very first shoe we're going to get into are these little Tory Burch slides. Yes, lots of people have them. I got the patent leather. I'm going to put everything down in the description bar so you guys can link them. But I got the patent leather without the little gold studs on them. They're pretty comfortable. Um, I do wear a seven and a half. These are those. My next purchase from Tory Burch. Um, yes, I know it's winter time, but I live in South Florida. So winter doesn't exist to me. <laughs> I got these. These come in so many let me close up for you guys i'm obsessed with these and these are a size seven um so comfortable so cute on like i said i know it's winter time but i do live in south florida mm -hmm. um i got these i got them in pink pink is my absolute favorite color but i'm not gonna lie they come in so many different colors i do not remember the price of everything i think these were like 188 and the other one's around the same price. But like I said, I'm going to put everything in the description box for you guys. So y'all can check them out. Um, what else am I going to I'm going to start off with these Nikes. My first pair of Nikes. They're Dunks. Um, I didn't know the extent of how hard it was to get shoes. I didn't realize that the sneakerhead community was crazy I had no idea um but these are the sneakers that I got I'm absolutely in love with them I do plan on posting these outfits on Instagram I know that's new for me right for me to say but these are so cute and I already have so many like cute little fits planned so do follow me on Instagram life is barb just like the name of this channel so you guys can see how I pair these shoes I did get these in a six and a half. Um, seven is comfortable for me, but also the six fits. So because these are so hard to find, um, I went ahead and I got them. I absolutely love these. I feel like you can't go wrong with black and white. I also want a fun pair and a red, black and white pair, but these will do for now. Like I already have stuff planned and stuff coming in the mail. Like I said, these are six and a half, and these were like two ninety before tax. I I'm gonna link these, but y'all not gonna be able to buy them like that. So unfortunately, I did not know it was so crazy. Now I get now I get why people are like resellers and this, and some people even buy their shoes from the H Gate. This is my first time hearing of this brand. It's called Farm Rio. Look how colorful this box is. Look how cute this box is um i looked on their website and you can still find these shoes on their website but i did buy this inside of a nordstrom on clearance so they're typically like 150 dollars or so um i got them for like 80 80 um but they're still on their site i checked and i looked so i will try to link this in the bio or i'll link it like the nordstrom version of it these shoes are very funky but just wait on me i have dresses that i can wear with this um what size are these these are seven and a half like i said i typically wear a size seven and a half of course it depends on how the shoe fits 
I can wear a seven. These are so cute, y'all. I have a green dress that I'm wearing these with. I have a white dress I can wear these with. Um, a pink dress that I can wear. Like they're just like slip. They're slip-ons. I think these are some kind of a mule. And they have a platform. I'm four foot eleven, so I will go for any type of platform. I love that. They're super comfortable, and as you can tell, easy to put on. Yeah, so these are from Rio. Love them. It's my first time, like I said, hearing of the brand by Warren Hartstrom. Uh, my next two pairs of shoes, I know I'm late. I'm about two years too late, but I'm here now, and I'm addicted. <laughs> from the very first pair I put on my feet, I fell in love with them, and I immediately hated the fact that I was in love with them. Um, these are the Alexander McQueen sneakers that became very popular during COVID and I know that every single model and fashionista was wearing them on Instagram. I did not, I've been living under a rock. I did not know about that. Like I said, these are my first few pairs of designer sneakers like oh my god they're beautiful so beautiful they smell amazing they look so good on my feet I got a 37 and a half which is supposed to be like a seven or a seven and a half um I love them I don't know how else to say that I love them so much I watch a ton of reviews and people talk about the tongue how the tongue scrapes like the front of your ankle. I know some people say get like clips to clip it back to fix that. I'm gonna of course try to wear socks to see if that doesn't bother me. But I know over time the leather softens because it is genuine leather. It better be for the price. Um, this specific pair, I think it was $6.31 for this. Um, I have seen these shoes on so many people I've seen people's shoes so beat up, I couldn't believe it, but they still rocking. So I think these are going to last me a very, very, very long time. And I'm going to do my best to not buy another pair. I really don't need another pair because I have this one, which is universal. It's going to be great. It's going to go over a lot. And the next pair I bought is like pretty special. It's also my favorite color. Um, and I'm obsessed with it. Hold on one second. I'm gonna get better with bringing you guys hauls but y'all know this is the box that it comes in really 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 good packaging it's gonna stay in the box so this is the next one This is the first pair that I tried on and I just knew it was gonna be a problem, like immediately. I was like, oh no, I should have never tried these on. <sighs> come on, uh, come on. Tell me these are not beautiful. Tell me this snakeskin pattern is not like the prettiest thing you've ever seen. And these are the laces. Everyone's telling me that the laces, let me try to go close up. It's so bright because it's white, that the laces like look great. They also did come with a second pair of white laces. Sorry, I'm out of frame. One second. Oh. They come like this. Both shoes come with an extra pair of laces. It has Alexander McQueen on the wrap and I guess their emblem. But you guys have to stay tuned and see how I wear, but I'm gonna I'm gonna show you guys how I plan on wearing these shoes, other than like whenever I feel like it. But these are so gorgeous. These are so gorgeous. These are also a 37 and a half. Um, this just this back detailing, like so gorgeous. The black ones have like Alexander McQueen written in gold on the back and on the tongue, and then this one is silver. It's like embossed in there. 
Yeah, I'm obsessed. I'm gonna do my best to keep these clean, but I just can't freaking wait. <laughs> this haul is not about this, but this is how I plan on wearing this, this shoe. And there will be like an outfit post on Instagram with this. Y'all, y'all. <laughs> This is a gorgeous, gorgeous dress for, from Anthropology. My first time shopping in there. And this is how I plan on wearing my Alexander McQueen shoes. It's gonna be so cute. I'm not going out on the 30 on the 31st, but I am going out on the first. Like having a girls' dinner. And of course I can wear this with heels, but I think it's gonna be like a real statement with the sneakers if it comes together i'm gonna post it. y'all gonna see it that's that's the plan <laughs> um so yeah i just wanted to show you guys my little shoe haul that i went on i kind of went a little shoe crazy but i feel like i got good pieces that i'm going to be able to really really wear These were $5.90 plus tax. I'm definitely going to like link all the shoes in the bottom so you can like click on them and find them for yourself. Um, again, for reference, I am a seven and a half. So I'm not, I don't know how these shoes are sold for people with bigger feet, but yeah. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up subscribe to the channel if you want to see more um also share the video thank you for watching if you got all the way through and you're here now you're a real one um leave any like comments on other shoes i should check out whether they're farm rio or other nikes that are accessible because i am not gonna run around like a chicken with no head looking for shoes like I didn't know that men had such a hard time. And I know girls are sneakerheads too, but mm -mm. it was a journey. And I'm so happy I have them. Like, I'm so happy. But anyway, bye y'all. Talk to y'all soon. This is flesh of my flesh and bone of my bone. She shall be called woman. It was all woman when you saw me. Any real people in this room?